So I'm just going to look at how you add pay items for any new items that you need to add to your payroll. So we're in the zero settings area and I'm just going to go to payroll settings. Then this will show you any payroll uh, items. So under the pay items tab here, um, then it will show you any items as they appear at the moment. So depending on your how your account set up, you may have lots or not many. So here you'll see, for example, we've got some allowances, overtimes, holiday pays, things like that. Um, you may have as many as a just a couple. Here, if I go add earnings rate, then we can put some detail in. So here, for example, let's say we want a public holiday earnings rate. Um, you can have a display name if you want it to display differently on the pay slips, but I'm happy for it to say public holiday. Then whether it's ordinary overtime or an allowance, so this is ordinary time. Whether the rate is a set amount, so if you have like a car allowance, it would be $100 a week or something. Um, a multiple of the ordinary rate, which is what we're going to do here, or a rate per unit if it's you know something that you're paid, maybe at an extra $5 an hour or something like that. So here we'll do it as a multiple of the earnings rate, and um, the multiple is going to be 1. So in other words, the public holiday is one times the normal earnings rate. So if someone's paid $20 an hour normally, they're paid $20 an hour for public holiday as well. Um, an expense account. So this is obviously different for every company, but we'll just put this to the wages and salaries. Um, PAYG withholding and super. So you get PAYG withholding and you get paid super on public holiday. If you've got an extra allowance that you don't have super, or pensions on um, or doesn't accrue tax, then you can tick or untick these. Um, and whether it accrues leave. So public holiday, uh, if you're paid for a public holiday, you still accrue leave as well. So we'll tick that on and then save that. And then when this refreshes, you'll see that there's now a public holiday allowance there.